my research is on big data analytics for cybersecurity. So really uh, advancing SIM in that space to uh, find advanced persistent threats, zero day malwares, and really move uh, the SIM world from being preventative to more of this active hunting uh, for threats. It's a large scale graph problem. And whether people want to admit that or not, moving people from tables and SQL joins to these uh, larger graphs and traversing them and finding anomalies in the graph uh, is going to advance cybersecurity, but at the same time, that's difficult. There's a lot of research around how to do it, but doing that applied cybersecurity graph analysis is really difficult. And GPUs are really helping accelerate that, both on the visualization and on the analytics side. We're still using traditional big data technologies like Hadoop, uh, HDFS, uh, Dockers, uh, NoSQL like Datastax, Cassandra. But what we're doing is we're doing a hybrid big data approach. We're integrating GPUs um, for visualization and a lot of the CUDA libraries and kernels. And so we're working with startups like uh, Graphistry who are uh, visualizing you know, three to four orders of magnitude more data and then uh, tying in some of the best research uh, out of universities as well as uh, some of the new packages that are coming out of NVIDIA like NVGraph. Uh, NVGraph really is starting to make the standardized uh, primitives uh, for you know, companies like BlazeGraph, for uh, a lot of the universities who are porting uh, CPU-based graph analytics to GPUs, and really kind of accelerating the whole industry uh, to do it in a way that it can communicate with each other and have efficiencies at scale. And the P100 uh, card and the uh, DGX1, the, the shared memory alone is really going to solve a lot of graph problems Typically in the graph world, we're partitioning, we're doing a lot of subgraph analysis, but when we can start moving you know, four billion node graphs onto a GPU um, and have the shared memory of all the other GPUs and have that connected processing power, is really going to cut out um, a lot of months of development cycles. The next steps for us are really uh, going to be around uh, scaling out graph analysis from uh, streaming GPU uh, graph analysis to the, uh, the longer graph analysis to the graph visualization to really um, empower cyber analysts.